A 12 News original new here at 10. Typically when you walk past a vending machine, you'll see snacks and sodas. But at Hampshire Fanat Elementary, kids will find something completely unexpected. A bunch of books. The school's principal calls this new investment priceless. 12 News reporter Amelia White stopped by the school to get the details behind this machine and how it works. Amelia. Jordan, I would have never thought to put books in a vending machine, but Hampshire Finette Elementary did. I was able to check out their new approach to motivate students to read. Can I help you? B7 isn't a honey bun or even a Dr. Pepper. At Hampshire Finette Elementary School, it's Charlotte's Web. And B8, it's a Hank the Dog book. Uh, when they brought the idea to me, again, we fell in love with it. We're, and the first thing is, is how do we make it happen? Principal Byron Miller says this unique vending machine was donated by the school PTA. Marion Campbell was the PTA treasurer. She says they received donations from banks, stores, and restaurants to stock this machine up with a variety of books. We could stock it with books that we think, right? But we're parents, you know, who better to get it from but the teachers and the kids. So we went around asking, you know, hey, what do y'all want to see in here? What do you want to strive to get? Now this vending machine doesn't take quarters or even dollar bills. It only takes golden tokens and they're earned by good behavior in the classroom. Good job. Students choose books based on their reading level. So Campbell says done. her son and his classmates love it. Whenever he feels like he earned something and he selected it himself, he's much more interested in it. Reading levels range from pre-K starting at the bottom to third grade. Curious George. Kids are excited about a different kind of treat. And my youngest is in kindergarten, and he was like, so I get a book every year. And I was like, absolutely. We love you. If you are interested in giving a monetary donation, you can contact Marion Campbell, Hampshire Fanet PTA Treasurer, at the number on the bottom of your screen. In studio, Amelia White, 12 News.